This video is powered by As Always Entertainment. If you enjoyed this content, consider becoming a patron over on patreon.com forward slash as always. For access to the Patreon exclusive podcast, The Kill Connor Clubhouse, early access to the Cinema Room podcast, being part of polls for future videos, and other early access material. With that said, please enjoy the video. This is potentially the stupidest video I've ever made, but it got a shit ton of votes on the poll. I don't know who the fuck suggested it, but whoever it was, <laughs> hate you. Merry not Christmas, you dickhead. Basically, the idea was that I play every single Assassin's Creed game. Or playing, playing Assassin's Creed, it was playing, it was playing Assassin's Creed, but every time you take damage, you play the next Assassin's Creed. And I hate it, but we're doing it. Is Assassin's Creed 1? Uh, it's, uh... Let's go with today's advent calendar video. Merry Christmas. What I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna delete my save because I don't want to lose my completed save. What I do want to do, however, is I'm just gonna load back into the game, and we're gonna we're gonna replay the game from the start, but without any of the modern day and whatnot because a load of bullshit. Assassin's Creed One. Here we go. This one need this not one die. Need not die. Bloody UKs. My blade is more powerful than all. Not, Not fortune. fortune. Skill. Watch, Watch a while longer and you might learn something. It'll teach you how to disregard everything the masters taught us. Oh, Altair, let's fucking go, boy. I want to die already. Why am I playing Assassin's Creed in 2019? What a bad franchise. <laughs> am I actually going to do this challenge seriously? Or, like, what am I doing? I don't even know if I'm, like, properly participating in this here challenge that I've set for myself, or whether I'm just sort of running through it as I normally would, and then if I just happen to take damage, then I move on, or whether I'm like really going to try my best not to take damage. If I do that, I might be here forever and play it all through all the game, so. The sooner we can face attention to the jackals are massive. You mean cowardice. That man is our greatest enemy. Here we have a chance to be rid of him. You have already broken two tenets of our creed. Now you would break the third. <laughs> That's my impression of Malik. Altair was a right bitch in this. I couldn't imagine Cass Anvar doing the arrogant Altair. That's why I'd love to see a remake or a remaster, at least just with Cass Anvar playing Altair, because I would love to see his take on the arrogant Altair. And what is it you want? Blood. Blood. No, not the things in which you made last, Asa. I spare you only that you may return to your. Ugh. That's classic I'll tell you, get a hurts hurt sounds. I actually don't know what I'm doing right now. Does that count as taking damage? No, it would just be if we lose a lose a, a thing, a, like a little notch on our health bar, then we move on to the next one. I feel like it's going to happen a lot quicker in the Ezio games because you're kind of thrust into combat right away. But in this game, you spend a lot of time not doing anything really until a little bit later on. But we'll see. We'll see how long it takes us. Jay, you cabbage farmer. You fucking rot brand cabbage. <laughs> oh, no. I feel like it's 2017. I'm making daily AC videos. And I'm scraping the barrel. But everyone asked me to do this for the advent card, so I have to do it. We're in Masyaf. Looks beautiful. Altair, you've returned. I love the writing in this game. Especially when Altair first speaks to Malik after this whole event with Kadar and everything and the apple. And, and Malik is like, safety and peace. And then Malik says, your presence here deprives, deprives me of both. And then... And then at the end, when Altair is, is attacking Masyaf Castle, and he, he says to Malik, safety and peace, Malik says, your presence here will deliver us both. And it's like, oh, mate, that the fucking character development, so sick. Altair's fucking redemption, I love it, it's brilliant. The only thing that would make it better is if they actually focused on the story and didn't act like it didn't exist because of the way the fucking cutscenes are done. You, you sometimes don't even notice what's going on. You can't differentiate one piece of dialogue from another sometimes. Like, you can't tell what's important and what's ah, side dialogue. It's 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 really strange. It would have been better to have proper cutscenes. Abbas looks like a fucking mong in this game. Right, almost to the tower. <laughs> kind of just want to throw myself off the edge and lose some health so I can move on. Uh, otherwise, we're going to be here for all day. Hey, Amalim, how's it going, buddy? I'm sure you want to see this whole cutscene, so I'll let it play in its entirety. Master, come forward. Tell me of your I'm joking. Fuck this. No. Not that. What? Man, this is what Assassin's Creed used to be. Grounded historical stories. How the fuck did they fall from this? Like, if you wanted to do something else, you... 
Ah, <laughs> uh, no. If they wanted to make a new franchise, why not just make a new franchise? I get it that you want to use the Assassin's Creed. I just... I just... It, 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 it's very strange to me that that's what they decided to do. Because you could have easily made a new franchise and made it very popular, but they decided to just ruin the Assassin's Creed name, all in the name of risking it for money, like... I understand Assassin's Creed used to be so grounded, and even in Origins, it was. It's really only Odyssey that's fucked it so very, 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 very much. Oh my god! This picks up exactly where we just finished. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they now? Lucy, where have you been? You you were gone. From, you were gone from the room for like for like three minutes. Where'd you go? Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe ten minutes. Maybe. Before they before figure they out what I've, I've done. done. If we're not out of here and on the road before then, wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I promise I'll answer all of your questions later. But right now, I need you to just shut up and do what I say. So please, get in the Animus. Alright. Here we go, boys. And this is how I'm going to play the whole thing, just talking over <laughs> all the cutscenes. Fun fact, when I was a child, um, I used to know the Assassin's Creed 2 script off by heart. I think I've forgotten a lot of it, but I think some of it is still retained in my noggin, noggin, up here, so. Assassin's Creed 2's character models genuinely look like shit sometimes. It is a boy. Oh no, he's dead. He's at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it? Am I too late? Give him here. Give him here. Giovanni. my love. It'll be alright. Say an auditore. To some combatente. Legs, empty hand, armed hand, head. That's my impression of Ezio crying. A fine set of lungs. What shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. We did it! This video should not be called what it's called. It should be called Madman Recites Assassin's Creed Scripts. Whoa, I'm gonna need a minute. Not a second, not a minute. Messed it up. Oh, Struga has some, some fucked, fucked up, up interior, interior decorators. Stay close. Hey, you're not supposed to be up here. Open this door. I'm calling it in. There's been a breach in the research wing. I repeat, there's been a breach. <laughs> Kill me. I rigged them to loophole footage. How do you think I managed to hide all your nighttime snooping from Abstergo? You're good. So I've been told. But they're on to us now. We need to hurry. Classic Desmond only been able to walk at this bit. I'd see the thing is, right, I'm 100% going to take damage before we even get to Ezio. Because Desmond cannot block when we're in that car park. I'm going to actually try my best to, like, use my epic assassino skills to avoid damage. But I don't think I'm going to be able to. It's near impossible. How many of them are there? This is, or NMI? What do you think, Lucy? Lucy? Here we go. Two, three, seven, four. No. Imagine doing 3247 like a stupid noob. 3274, boys, just go. Let's go. Penguin walk. Okay, let's do our best here, but we are gonna get fucked. There's no chance we're gonna get out of this without be taking damage. I'm gonna try, though. Oh, God, they're all following me. Oh, God, they're all following me. Oh, dear. Go on, Lucy. Punch one of them, at least. Oh, God, wait. Desmond Campbell. Ah. Oh. Balls. And here we go. Oh my god, we're playing the best Assassin's Creed. The message is delivered. We are gone now from this world. All of us. We can do no more. The rest is up to you, Desmond. What? Who is Desmond? I don't understand. Please wait. I have so many questions. We'll never have them answered, Ezio, sadly. Il Vaticano, December 1499. Alright, out we go. The Pope left his sheath, sheath behind. That's not what that is. I don't know. Go on, Ezio, let's get that bloody staff. Wait, does that mean the staff? It's us, it's Creed Major Sleepy. Does that mean the staff is still under the Vatican, even now? Could Desmond go there and get it? Well, not now, he's dead. Up we go, gamers. Ah, fuck shit. Come on. You would not believe the things I've seen, Mario. Sure to stay alive that I might hear of them. Expect opposition. 
And I expect the Borgia to mourn the loss of many lives tonight. Alright, let's go, Mario. Let's get out of here. I'm done with this. It's crazy stuff going on in this vault. Crazy stuff. Why is my health down? Oh! Did I lose health when I fell? I might have done. Let's just pretend I didn't. That's fine. We'll just pretend I didn't. Because I wasn't paying attention. And I don't know. So, I mean, the rules are the rules. But I died in, I didn't notice, so I can't make the decision based off of that, can I? I remember blunted his attacks. My armor. It blunted his attacks. Alright, let's go. Get out of my way, boys. We're going, we're going, getting out of Rome. Alright, I'm going to need you to catch up, boy. Okay, this is where I know we're going to fuck things up. Okay. I'm going to try and do better than just, like, complete shit this time. Because I feel like this this is the game where we can... Oh, God. Look at that. We got through a fight without taking damage. That's crazy. Wow. Good job, James. Pat on the back. Nailed it. Lovely job. Go on, Mario. Just keep on going. No, Mario. Go on. You got to do this. All right. There's more enemies here. Here we go. That was a mistake. Oh my god, you can't even skip it in this game. Oh my god, you can't even skip it in this game. Oh my god, I gotta fucking watch this stupid fucking recap for a game. Your life has changed so much in so little time. Two months ago, you were pouring shots for bankers and celebrities. But now look at you. One of us. One of the good guys. Isn't that nice? I shouldn't know this, but I do. Someone hang me. Oh, and we're in the Animos. Epic Gaming. A game boy. Ubisoft Montreal, Ubisoft Annecy, Ubisoft Bucharest, Ubisoft Kiev, Ubisoft Massive, No! Ubisoft Singapore? <laughs> I have been in Acre a week now, safe and in high spirits, but prepared for the worst. The men and women who fed and sheltered me here also give me warning that the road to Mazda is overrun by mercenaries and bandits not native to this land. What could mean? I dread to guess. When I first set out from Roma 10 months ago, I did so with a single purpose, to discover what our father did not. In a letter written the year before my birth, he makes mention of a library hidden beneath the stones of Masyaf Castle, a fortune full of invaluable wisdom. Bam, bam, bam. What will I find when I arrive there? Who will greet me? A host of your Templars, as I fear more strongly. Or nothing, or nothing but the, but the whistling of a cold and lonely wind. Masyaf has not been home to the assassins for almost 300 years now. Can we still claim it for our own? Are we welcome there? I am wary of this fight, Claudia. Not because I am tired, but because our fire seems to move in one direction only. Towards chaos. I have more questions than answers. This is why I've come so far. To find clarity, find, find the wisdom, wisdom left behind by the great Altair, so that I may better understand the purpose of our fight, my place, my place in it. it. Should anything happen to me, Claudia, should my skills fail me, or my ambition lead me astray, do not seek retribution or revenge in my memory, but fight to continue the search for truth, so that all may benefit. My story is one of many thousands. And the world will not suffer if it ends too soon. Oh, my boy. Let's go. I'm pumped. I'm ready. Here we go. Follow Altair, my friend. Let's go. We got to climb to the top of Masyaf Castle. When we get there, I'll have a wank. Right, gamer, you want some? Yeah, he does. Oh, we even did the full sync like a true gamer. Gamer out of Torre, they call me. Well, please, call me Ezio. <laughs> Hidden blood. Broken blood. Sword. We've got this sword. We've got it back. So we got this sword there. We've retrieved it from inside of the temple. And when you get it, you're going to be getting double XP upon hit. And it is going to be fucking incredible. And this is where you find the bit of stones. So we've got to keep doing all the kills here. And this is how you get maximum XP. I didn't take damage because I was blocking. Which means we are all good to keep continuing onwards. And you're going to come here with me, sir. And we're going to stab you. We're going to hit you with the fucking mallet. Let's go. We're on a mission to climb to the top. Of the castle. So here we've got a bit of gaming, and when you do a bit of gaming, you get maximum XP in real life. 
when I last visited my parents for Christmas, I ended up getting double XP for their for both of their Christmas presents, and they were delighted to find that in their stockings. <laughs> no! Oh god, that was close. We nearly died. We're okay though. Oh, you stupid cuck. Well, that's it. We've played all the Assassin's Creed games, guys. So thanks for joining me. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you all next time. <laughs> What's that? You want to you wanna play Assassin's Creed 3? Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I will go fuck your mother. Merry Christmas. <laughs>